Got a bad case of cabin fever today, I can tell you. Early January, man, I am just sick of sitting inside. And uh, so, drove about an hour, hour and 15 minutes away from my house, got a little further south, and uh, not quite as much snow. So, man, wish me luck. I'm gonna just go. If I find one horn, I will be so happy. Gotta love New Mexico. That elk bed's about as fresh as can be. Beautiful sights. Beautiful day, man. Wind's blowing a little bit, but it's just, it is a beautiful day out here. And uh, man, I've got into the elk sign, um, but I just haven't found a shed yet. I've been hiking since about 1.30 and uh, yeah, I just, man, I mean, the elk, the elk are in here now, and I would say that this, you know, somewhere in this vicinity is where they will be um, when they shed this year. Obviously, I'm looking for old sheds, but uh, we found, we have found sheds around this mountain, basically on this same shelf or this same level, but... Man, I'm gonna keep hitting it. This is beautiful country, beautiful day, blessed to be out here. And uh, let's just keep going, see if we can turn something yeah, up. I'm starting to kind of lose heart a little bit and just starting to go across this plain and get ready to start going, working my way down this ridge. And you know, this ain't the way I like to find them for sure. But I come around through here and boom, that's what I saw right there. A little five by. <coughs> I'm gonna guess that somebody, somebody shot him during season this year at some point. Um, or, or a lion got him, I don't know which. First shed hunt of the year, early January. And uh, I mean, it's at least good to find something we're gonna keep on looking maybe we can find a shed here somewhere hopefully that's what i'm wanting to find we found some big ones in this area before all right if i find a shed i'll get back with you my first glassing point was right up there at about 1 30 today and uh Man, I'm down in this gully, you can't see, but I went way back that way. And, uh, man, still didn't have no shed for the pack. And coming back, headed to the truck, coming right down this trail, right here, I turned and looked. Look at that right through that tree right there. Finally, got a little, little four by deer shed, it looks like. Let's go over here and, and see. And then we're gonna look around right in here. Maybe we can find the other side. Wouldn't that be neat? Can't even tell how old it is or anything really, but. Oh wow, I think it's a hard white maybe. Yeah, I think it's a hard white. There. Oh yeah. Well, been making loops trying to find this match, this hard white little four by deer shed that I picked up here a minute ago. And I don't know, I've been going about 15 minutes and just, man, I don't know. I can't, can't find him. May have been one of those where they just walk off a mile before they drop the other one. But I walked up on one that's, my goodness, it's old. Look at there, it had some kind of 
end line at some point coming out of the middle of it. But it's so old it just completely just eat it off. Well, that's a wrap for today. Never did find that match, but that's how it goes sometimes. But January the 6th, first shed hunt of the year. And uh, I'm excited, man. I'm ready to get get going. I I, uh, I want to do something this year. Last, last season, um, or last year, I found uh, me and me and our, our group. There's about three of us mainly. Sometimes, uh, sometimes five of us. But um, when we stopped counting, we had found 424 or 26 sheds last year. And uh, so I want to try to uh, do a race to 500. See if we can find 500 this year. So we're going to try it. We're going to do our best. And I uh, hope y'all come along for the ride. It's going to be a good time. Beautiful sunset back behind me. And this is Navajo Lake. There's the spillway, Navajo Dam. So beautiful. I had to just stop and take a short video. January 9th. Me and Stephen Lane fixing to head out and make a shed hunt. He just got home from work. Got us a little lunch pack. Got our walkie talkies right here. And we're gonna run down to New Mexico and uh, do a little do a little shed hunt. So man, it's a snowy looking day outside. But maybe we can find some. Let's go. We got Misty with us today. We're gonna to see if we can train this dog to find some sheds too. Ready, Bob? Yep. All right, this is Steven's, Stephen Lane's dog, Misty. She's gonna hike with us today. Hopefully we're gonna be able to make a shed dog out of her. But uh, what is it, the eighth? No, ninth. January 9th. I made one shed hunt a couple days ago, and uh, this is Stephen Lane's first. First shed hunt of 2020. Yep. The race to 500 yep. officially begins. What did we find last year? 420 something? Yeah, something like that. So here we go. All right, we're headed up there. Come go with us. Come on, Misty. Going to dad now. He just hollered and said he found a pretty nice four by, so let's go over there. See what he has. Nice. <laughs> a nice four by. Yeah. Oh, looks, like yeah. A, looks like a two year old. Um. Take that any day. Yeah, man. Come here, Misty. Misty, Misty, come here, come on, look right here, look right here, look right there, look right there. She don't even know what she's looking for. Oh man, <laughs> that's a good girl, that's a good girl. It's gonna be our new shed dog right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, <laughs> look at her, look at her. <laughs> yeah, bring it along that's now. That's a good girl, that's a good girl. Yeah, that's what we're looking for right there. That's what we're Hold looking it up, for, so Misty. Look at that. Look at that. A nice little bug right there. Hey. <laughs> All right, we'll get back with you if we find some more. Oh, yeah. All right, here we go. We're going over here. Steven just found his first shed. And I'm going to get him to tell you what he just said to me whenever, whenever he hollered at me. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, I see it sticking up. Woo -hoo -hoo. So I took, All right. I stopped, Misty was standing right here. I went to take a picture of her like this. And I went and I took this picture. Look. Let me see, let me see. 
<laughs> so oh, it's awesome. Camera. Number two, baby. Oh man. That's see that's dude that Everybody could be that could be the match uh oh, to that old God. one I found. There's been nobody in here, huh? I, I don't Me and Misty coming through here fixing to go up this mountain. And uh there's part of the broke off part of the horn right there. Just found a little Ford by right over here. A few minutes ago, I was walking up the ridge and uh, jumped a big old bull at like 15 yards. Um, his right side was busted clean off of both his two brow tines. So that was pretty cool. Anyways, look at the shit. Buried down in this ditch. Anyways, let's pick it up. It's older than the hills. But... Yeah, that thing. Big old base. Had to have been an old there. That thing is huge. Base. Old. Anyways, we'll get back with you. We find some more. Well, only I can find a bull this day and it's already shed his horns. Smell that misty? Huh? Smell that misty? All right. Um, so we left that spot. We just found those four and um, came over here to another spot. We wanted to check out and scout a little bit. And uh, we've been walking for probably 20 minutes or so, but uh, we were on the other side of the road that we were on and now I've crossed over and I'm not a hundred yards from the truck on the other side and I already got a shed. It's a four by but it's busted off. Anyways. Would have been a pretty decent horn too. Old main beam is busted off. Anyways, I'll get back with you if we find some more. <laughs> 